Hello, I'm a shark and it's Shark Week. This week on Pebbles for Sale is Shark Week and I decided that I was going to try to teach you a little bit about sharks and I chose the whale shark because they seemed nice. So put up with my awful drawing skills while I teach you a small part about the whale shark. Yay! So the whale sharks are the second largest fish and I am going to draw an awful whale shark here, an equal sign, and a large fish. So that's my visual representation of that. But the discovery told me that it was the second largest fish, so in my research I decided to look up what the first largest fish was, and it just kept telling me that it was a whale shark. And I'm going to take discovery's word that the whale shark is in fact the second largest fish, which is actually the wild wolf. So if anybody can find the first large fish, please leave it in the comments. I'd like to know. So a whale shark is approximately the size of a school bus, which is really quite large and scary. So here is me drawing an awful school bus. And then I am going to put a awful whale shark underneath because I suck at Whale sharks like to live in tropical warm waters. And here is me drawing a map of where the whale sharks live. And they live in a long kind of bar area around where it's warm. So this is a long bar area that I was talking about that they live in. And yeah, see, whale sharks live here. I think that's what I'm going to write. And here is where my pen stopped working, so I decided that using paper and chalk would be a good idea. Clearly it wasn't, but please bear with me. Um, whale sharks, they migrate to the western coast of Australia when it gets colder. So here is me drawing a whale shark on the western coast of Australia. Like fish, a group of whale sharks is called a school. So here's me drawing a group of whale sharks. Yeah. And they're called a school. So if you can't remember, just watch Finding Nemo and then they'll tell you that a group of fish is called a school. Whale sharks are considered carnivores and they're kind of like bottom dwellers and their favorite food is plankton. And plankton are really, really small shrimp-like creatures and they can't swim across the current because they're so small and that's an interesting little fact about plankton. I decided that would probably be a good idea to actually show you a picture of an actual whale shark. So this is what they look like. They're not intimidating like I've been drawing them. And they're really large. So here, yeah, an actual whale shark so you guys are missing for. Thank you for watching and listening to me. Terribly explaining to you a few facts about the whale shark. And yeah, thank you for my horrible, horrible drawing skills and the fact that my pen ran out of the volume after back next week so this week I thought I took a little break because I'm pretty swollen from my surgery and yeah this is my only excuse because I've been sitting at home basically eating ice cream and watching doctors all day but I will see you next week.